Hey, what's up, guys? FruitBerries here. Welcome back to another UHC. Um, I played a game before this, and I got B-hopped on, so that was fun. So hopefully that doesn't happen. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the game. All right, so as you can see, we spawned pretty close to 0-0, zero, zero, and we are in a snow biome, which gives me the absolute perfect idea, and I know exactly what I'm doing now. Something I am good at doing very well is making snow traps, and I know this for a fact. Uh, my Every time I make a snow trap, it literally never, like, fails unless I'm the one who messes it up. Like, snow traps are so good you have no idea i forgot to mention uh i have hand cam as you can see in the top right uh my webcam and my mouse and stuff and mouse pad should all be in the description if you are interested but i'm just gonna say my webcam right now is the razor keo and i have the ring light uh turned on so basically what a snow trap is is we're gonna get a bit of snow we're gonna make a crafting bench and we're gonna make snow blocks and then we're gonna craft snow sheets. And basically, if we put sheets above sand or above like logs, we can hide literally any block with snow, which makes it the perfect tool to use as a trap. So yeah, basically we're just gonna get a lot of wood and then we're gonna look and see how close this snow biome is to zero zero and we're gonna make a trap out of it. It's gonna be pretty easy to actually like make the trap. The only hard part is I gotta get iron and stuff. So I think I actually might get iron before I make the trap. So we got all the wood, bang, bang. Get sticks and crafting tables. And let's go look for a cave. All my other questions like sensitivity, FO, uh, FOV, uh, DPI, all those stuff are in the description too. And yeah. Also hotkeys, as you can see the mouse I'm using has two side buttons. The top side button is my 8 key and the bottom side button is my 9 key. And as you can see we found a cave in iron, so this is a good start. The ideal amount of iron that I'm looking for is around 35 iron ore. Should be just enough to make everything that I need, so I'll be back when we have enough. So as you can see, once I mine this iron, we will have the amount I needed, which is 35. Uh, we have a bit of extra as well. We can make a quick pick and we can make all of our packs. Then what we can do is make some buckets, full iron armor, and a sword. There you go. Now it is time to go to zero zero. I just realized how close I am to zero zero. Jeez, this snow biome is so close to zero zero. This trap is like, if there's no cheaters in this game, I feel like I have a very good chance at winning. Uh, hoping that I don't mess anything up. So there we go, we got all the flowers that we will literally ever need. Now we're just gonna get some dirt, and we're gonna get some, uh, some snow. There we go. And let's go get some snow. And we need to actually get to find a spot to make this quick, because as you can see, there's only four minutes till PvP turns on. Perfect. So let's make a bunch of snow blocks and then uh, off to look for somewhere to make the trap. There we go. A stack and 31 snow. That should be more than enough. So we're going to go look for somewhere to actually build this. Preferably in between trees, like somewhere like this, where you kind of just run in between some trees and there's not much of a way the person can dodge it. Like right in between like here is a good spot. We're also going to make some shears and we're going to get some extra leaves so we can make this better. And like I said, this thing is going to be so hidden. So we're going to set up the cords here. And the way I'm going to do that is I'm going to rename my toggle sprint to the exact cords. Uh, and in that case, negative 70, uh, 115. And we're going to put south. So I'm just going to go here. We're going to put negative 70. Uh, 115 and then the S and there we go as you can see my toggle sprint has been renamed to my coordinates this is my personal way of like setting my cords it's really cool all right I think I'm gonna make my trap this size this size should be good and there we go 
it's time to start setting this bad boy up. We actually need sand, which is something uh, I completely forgot. And then we can set this bad boy up. All right, perfect. We have two minutes to put this armor on, and let's get to let's get to work. Perfect. All right. So now that we have the flower, uh, the, the dirt and the flowers gone, so the sand is floating. Basically, if I put a block next to the sand or above the sand, it will make every piece of sand that is connected fall, and that's how the trap works. Something I do want to test is: Can you place a pressure plate on snow? The answer is yes. That is how we're going to be activating it. We're just going to put a pressure plate down, and the trap will be activated. Every time I punch uh, sand with a pickaxe or a shovel, it gives me haste for a tiny bit. So I have a piece of sand below me, and I keep repeatedly hitting it just so I can mine a tiny bit faster. Every time I break it, I can mine around six blocks of uh, stone on average. But ores will make it a lot easier. It gives me 50 seconds of haste, too. So this is going to take me a while, but this will be done soon, I promise. So there we go, all the room is dug down. Now every block that is above the hole, we are going to break uh, one more down so we can put fences down here. Fences will make it a lot harder for them to get out later, and I'll explain what I mean by that. So let's uh, make this amount. Let's make a bunch of these, and let's make a bunch of slabs. There we go. So we're going to start by putting wooden fences. Then we're going to put cobblestone walls. And then we're going to put uh, wooden slabs. And doing this basically means to get out, they have to use their axe, then their pickaxe, and then their axe to get out. It's very hard for people to get out of stuff like this. And hopefully this guy isn't cheating. I thought he was. I thought I don't know how he didn't see this hole. I also need to make signs, which is the last thing I need to do, so I can actually uh, make it so people can't get out of this thing. So once everyone is gone out of distance, we're going to make some signs, and then we're done. The reason I'm breaking these blocks is because I want to have uh, the alternating pattern that I have at the bottom uh, inside of the trap. So wood, cobblestone, and then wood, which is going to make it a lot harder for them to get out. Yeah, hopefully no one's near me because I'm gonna have to be unshifted for quite a long time because to place a sign You need to be uncrouched, which is bad. I Definitely do not have enough of these so we're gonna have to make a lot more We have enough to cover all the walls, but we need to cover the inside which means we're gonna need an extra 12 Yeah, an extra 12 3 6 9 12 Boom, okay once we get these uh, all placed down, we should be good. Perfect. Trap is done. Now we just need to go actually trap people. Okay, perfect. Uh, now we also have a way to uh, reset the trap. So yeah, we are 100% done now. No more joking around. And uh, we're going to go up and trap people. All right. It's time to win the game. Oh, God. There's a person behind me. I was not paying attention. God. Okay, so let's get on top of these trees because it's gonna be a lot harder for him to actually get me up here. I don't know if he knows that I'm trapping, but he's a nicked player and he has stuff, so I don't know if I want to do this. I think I'm just gonna let him go for now because I don't want to trap that guy. That guy is scary. Also, already kind of forgot where my trap is. It's right in between here. There's people fighting right here, and it's two completely different people than the people I saw earlier, so we can try to trap one of them. I mean, it's gonna be hard. There's like only 16 people left, but that's a decent amount. Hit him twice. We're gonna run back. But yeah, that guy, that full iron is dead. Oh my god, I need to run. I need to get that stuff because that guy had a better sword than me. Or not. Okay, I guess we're we're not getting that stuff then. Because we need to go this way. Got him. Perfect. He has an axe, but it's a wooden axe, I think.
Oh my god. Yes! Yes! That was so good. Sharpness 3 diamond. A golden apple. That was amazing. We need that. We need dirt. That shovel. Someone's here. Yep. Get him out. Perfect. Make a golden head. The beatdown hitting through blocks. <laughs> he thinks I'm cheating? Are you serious? I'm gonna go up there and kill him, I think. Oh, he's blocking up my trap. Look at this guy. This guy's a jerk. Come here, boy. I'm not letting you get away. He thinks I'm cheating, so I think he's gonna run for me instead of fighting me. Oh. There's just a guy watching. Yeah, why is he just watching? Please boost me. Thank you. Nice. Good job. One more shot. Nice. I need the fire sword. Got it. Get this guy. Yes! Let's go! Holy, a lot of gaps. We need to eat these before we die. Woo! That was terrifying. He also had a dragon sword, but I'd rather use the fire aspect than anything. Oh my god, we should not be alive right now. I was not doing too good in that fight, but it's whatever, I don't care. We can make full diamond because we can make a redstone block. And then we can make, um, it's not switching. There we go. Tarnel, look at me go. Full diamond. We're going to duplicate some apples. Dude, I'm so shaky. I'm going to be honest. Like, it is so hard to aim right now. <laughs> oh my God, that was crazy. I have everything I need to repair the trap. So let's go do it real quick. I can't believe we might actually win this game. I'm so happy. It's so hard for me to win these. Like, there's so many hackers. It's insane. I got pretty lucky with this game. That guy thought I was a hacker, which is pretty funny. Someone's in my trap, by the way. They're also on seven health. Hey, what's up, dude? <laughs> How did you even find my trap? How did you even get in here? Someone's above me. Oh. I think you're you're hacking. I'm dead. I'm dead. We're gonna try to obsidian trap him though. Got him. Oh my God, yes, he's dead. What? Hello? He's not taking damage. He drank deuce, I think. Yeah, there we go. Nice. So let me explain what just happened. He drank a potion called the deuce ex machina. And what that potion does is for 10 seconds, you take zero damage to uh, enemy attacks. And uh, that's why he kind of just like sat there and didn't die is because he had that potion on. He also had a barbarian's chest plate, which gives you these two effects, which is nice.
But yeah, I mean, I guess we, I guess we're abandoning the trap because there's only four minutes left, and there's no reason to try to use it. Fusion helmet, nice. All right, let's go up. That was insane. All right, so let's make, uh, let's make a G head real quick so we don't get murdered by someone. There we go. Uh, I think we can win this game. I don't think anyone else has any gear, so. I think this is a free win now. Yeah, as you can see, our trap is completely destroyed and there's only three minutes left, so I guess it's time to go fight people. I'm gonna take this opportunity uh, before deathmatch starts. If you would like the cape that I am wearing, or if you would like to take a look at my merchandise and maybe purchase some, the links for both of those are going to be at the top of the description. Alright, let's eat a gap, and then, uh, it's time to go to the middle. I keep picking up things. Go away. Alright. Uh, I should be able to get middle unscathed. I shouldn't have any issues. For some reason, no one went middle at all, so. Sick. Yeah, I just get a free win. I just gotta go style on everyone. What should I kill everyone with? I don't have another, like, sword, so I guess I'm gonna have to just... Use the fire sword. <laughs> Goodbye. I can use an iron axe to kill everyone. Let's do it. See this guy? Lotus Flower 17. This man's about to get iron axe to death. Here, I'll butterfly click for you guys, which I'm not as good at. Oh, okay. That guy's dead. He had a stack of gold. Oh my god. Get away from me. You're so loud. Well, that was interesting. Uh, I don't want this guy to steal the kill, so we need to go kill him before he- Oh my god. Oh, time to iron axe this guy. I'm gonna try butterfly clicking, like I said, but I'm not that good at doing it on my left click and aiming, so beware. I'm gonna get destroyed, probably. Or not. Okay, damn. He's on five. I'm using an iron axe. Let's just make a chest of fate. Why not? Nice. Look at my health. Bang. Let's just make... Let's make a bunch of crafts. Let's make a pea box. Just like so. Thank you very much. There you go. Take it. Drink it. Drink it up. And I'm going to beat you to death with a stone shovel. Let's go. <gasps> oh my god. No! Dude, my arm hurts. Oh, my shovel broke. Iron shovel time, let's go. <laughs> oh my god. This guy's getting feed. Get in there. He's on seven. Oh! Let's go! Nice! We have so much gold. GG. Well, yeah, I guess. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the hand cam. And uh, before I end the video, since uh, a lot of people don't know... Hey, what's up? It's me. Uh, I'm wearing a really weird shirt right now. I apologize, but... Hey, hope you enjoyed.